Boys and ghouls, this is the moon goddess, and this video is going to be for the sign of Gemini. We're going to do something different today. This is uh, the Buddha wisdom cards for the divine masculine and the divine feminine. Uh, basically, your twin flame. If you're not familiar with what the twin flame is and what uh, divine masculine and divine feminine, I did do a video about what they are um, earlier this week. So feel free to look those up. Give me a thumbs up. Just kidding. Uh, all right, so I picked up three cards for each. Uh, the first one is for the Divine Masculine. Um, guard your mind with vigilancy, nurture the positivity, and remove the negativity. Um, then your mind will find peace. Um, I do feel that Spirit's calling for you to release anything negative or any one negative in your life right now. And um, I feel like they're giving you the courage to do so. All right, guys? The second one is watch yourself, awaken yourself, be awakened, dreamer who dreams. Um, I do feel with this card, it's calling for you to seek inside yourself and um, face certain truths, okay? That maybe you are suppressing. Um, yeah, okay. The next one is, how hard is it to stand in truth? How easy it is to lose yourself to desire? Yeah, I do feel that some of you are, um, I want to say like in denial, um, about certain things or you're just not ready to face some things that you need to face and um, I feel that Spirit is giving you the courage to do so okay guys and this will be for your higher self all right the next card is for the divine feminine first one compassion does not see faults of others it does not see the weakness of people it has no ego um, I feel with this card is calling for you to have more uh, compassion and love and be more gentle towards others. I know sometimes it's hard. Um, like if someone's wronged us, we kind of like want to jump and be like, well, fuck that guy. Fuck her. They did this or that for me. Um, try to see things from both sides and, you know, walk in their shoes. Again, I know it's hard sometimes. Easier said than done. But um, just at least try. <laughs> All right. The next one is... Seeing divinity in everyone and everything, you are nurturing your Buddha nature. Okay, so again, with this card, it's asking you to see the good in everyone. Everyone has good and bad. Um, try to focus on the good, okay? The last card is don't let worldly temptations lead you astray. This card basically speaks for itself. But remember, guys, not everything that glitters is gold. Some things are just temporary. They might look good for you or you, you know, or you might feel like, you know, this would be something fun or whatever, or a good temptation, like especially anyone who's uh, in a relationship and they might see like a hot girl or a hot guy and you might want to, you know, go astray. But remember, that's just temptation. It's only temporary. Do you see something long, a good relationship, something meaningful with this person? Probably not. You know, it's just temptation. It's just temporary. All right, guys. Um... So I hope this video was a blessing to you. And if you would like to bless me, you can tip or donate and PayPal me, MoonGoddess11. Um, I really appreciate your subscriptions, uh, your thumbs ups, and your comments. They mean so much to me, guys. They really do. I really appreciate it. And uh, stay magical. Bye, guys.